Men, if you like your pogo stick working the way it's supposed to work, stop wearing polyester underwear. Polyester underwear actually has negative side effects on your sperm count and ability to complete the job. Uh, there's a study done in 1993 on dogs. I don't know why this is on dogs, but they put, they put underwear on dogs and found that cotton underpants versus polyester underpants had a big difference actually. The dogs that wore polyester underpants for, now this is 24 months long, continuously. I don't know how they had dogs in underwear for 24 months, but they did it. Um, the group that wore polyester showed significant decreases in sperm count with an increase in abnormal forms of the sperm. Uh, and then upon biopsying these poor dogs in underwear, they found degenerative changes in their ball sacks. Okay, well that's dogs, right? That's not humans, that's dogs. Well, let me tell you another one. In 1996, there was a study with 50 men. They found that 100% polyester underwear or a 50% polyester, 50% cotton blend underwear also had effects on your boys. There was diminished ratios of mounting to completing the job and sexual acts, meaning they didn't finish as many times as they attempted to finish uh, and get the party going. Uh, six months post-study though, their numbers went back to normal. So that did not stay with them over the long term. It didn't, it didn't last. They did go back to normal. So there's that for you. <laughs> okay, let's talk about why is this? Why does it matter if you're wearing polyester underpants or cotton underpants? But why, why does it affect your sperm health? Well, there's a study done in 1993 that suggested that polyester, polyester underwear creates an electrostatic field across the sack. And that disturbs the testicular function. And that's why it causes so many problems. So I'm not saying it's going to cure everything for you, but men, stop wearing polyester underwear. Ladies, I'm not sure what it does to us yet, but I will deep dive it and I will let you know.